Your co-star, Sean William Scott. Sean was here, yeah. He was on the show the other day, and uh, he, of course, you know, he, he's uh, made Stifler, uh, an iconic character yep. in the movies. And then I was talking to him, and he said that actually you are the most like Stifler, Stifler in, in real life. Right. Which I found very hard to believe, because your character is, is so mild-mannered, and then I can't believe that you're a perv. Well, okay. <laughs> to, to, to be clear, I'm not a perv. Um, I think what he means, I hope what he means, is that uh, I tend to um, I I do things that are a bit shocking and, and maybe seem a bit out of character for me. I, I tend to, uh, you know, um, g go to sort of darker places, say things that people uh, wouldn't expect, you know, me to say, or yeah. anyone to say for that matter. Well, I, I, that, that would be the case, yeah. I think. Maybe that's the comparison he's yeah, trying to Yeah, perv, I think, is the, no, no, okay. I'm <laughs> Got it, I got it, so, well, you know, so perv. I, I, yeah. I, you know, not perv, uh, but I, uh, I'm perv. Uh, no, uh, <laughs> then I saw you, you, tweet, you sent out a tweet uh, not long ago that said that you were getting rid of your stripper pole. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I well, thought, um, well, who, who has a stripper pole in their home? Well, I did. Um, my, uh, I came home one day and uh, my wife um, had gotten a, a stripper pole um, that she uh, wanted me to install in our living room, which is... Oh, it comes, it's like the Ikea stripper yeah, pole? Yeah, it's like one of these, I, I think it was... <laughs> I think it was like, maybe the Huffman Coos version, but it was. Yeah. Um, but uh, you know that's funny on a lot of levels. One that she wanted a stripper pole in our living room, and two that she thought that I would actually put it together and do any kind of work at all. But yeah. um, so anyway, she we compromised because I was like, we're not putting this in the living room. We're not having a stream. This is ridiculous. And she's like, why? You know, we compromised. We put it in a guest bedroom, which um, at the time was. Uh, Jenny was sort of, my wife was sort of using it as like her little meditation room. We called it the Zen Den. Right. And then we put up this stripper pole. Again, not me, but I think we paid somebody. And then, um, uh, so then it became the champagne room. And, and um, you had a little, you had like a, a, a little will, stripper room in your, yeah. in your house. Yeah, yeah. And then eventually this will be the, the kids' room when we have a kid. So I think that's, <laughs> that's I nice. think that's a perfectly natural progression <laughs> right, of what right. this room should be. Sure. Yeah. You know? Kids will love it. Whee! Okay. Kids do love it. No, we have, people used to come over. It used to be so much fun, Conan. People would come over, they'd bring their kids, they'd dance on it, they, I would get on it. I would Purell it first from top to bottom, but I would, I would get on there and it'll be fun one day to tell them, you know, be in there with my son or daughter and be like, you know, this is, this is where mommy used to dance for daddy's dollars, you know? It'll be cute. It'll be cute to tell a little story. Uh, mommy to danced for daddy's dollars. Yeah, I think it'll be sweet, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so it's gone now, all right? The poll is... It, it, it is, yeah. She, she um, finally uh, uh, gave it. I mean, it was literally right in the middle of the room. And by the way, we would still have guests over, you know? I mean, my parents would come and stay with us, and they'd be in there, because there was also a bed right. in the room. Um, how convenient. It was kind of yeah. convenient, actually. <laughs> um, but yeah, so my, you know, my parents would be in here, and there'd be a stripper pole right next to them. Did they was, ever try it out? Like, this is pretty yeah. cool. I, I, I would rather you not uh, yeah, I wonder if my parents <laughs> were using... Here's Snoop Dogg coming from the room <laughs> late at night.